One of Sheikh Nasser's daring letters from prison, Sheikh Nasser said, contrive anything you may wish against me and give me no respite. Conspire against me without delay. If you have anything more than crucifixion and killing, then bring it on. I don't care when I'm being killed as a Muslim in which way I die for the sake of Allah. وَذَلِكَ فِي ذَاتِ الْإِلَهِ وَإِنْ يَشَأْ يُبَارِكْ عَلَىٰ أَوْصَالِ شِلْوٍ مُمَزَّعِي Because this is for Allah's sake. And if He wishes, He will bless my torn limbs and broken joints. When we take on the task of da'wah, especially during times like this, we already know our lives in freedom, in honor, are at stake. In fact, we would be astonished not to be treated with hostility. Sometimes it gets to the point where you need to enlighten the enemies that there's nothing they can do to harm you. And there's nothing that they can do that you don't expect because we know our enemies. Sheikh Nasser mentioned in that same letter, the same quote Ibn Taymiyyah mentioned, what can my enemies do to me? My paradise is in my heart. It goes with, where, with me wherever I go. To imprison me is to provide me with seclusion. To send me into exile is to send me away in the path of Allah. And to kill me is to make me a martyr. We ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to delight our eyes with his release because his specific condition and conditions like his melt every heart if that heart has any Islam and Iman 